Todd's Carpet and Tile Cleaning. Call or text 702-595-0488. Sunday, October 1st, marked former President Jimmy Carter's 99th birthday. Today in Charlotte, North Carolina, with the help of country music superstars Garth Brooks and Trisha Yearwood, the 37th Jimmy and Rosa Lynn Carter work project kicked off. Well, the, the cool thing about Habitat and the, the way that Garth and I have been involved over the last 15 years with the Carter work project has been that we get to build. We get to actually get out and swing a hammer. The house behind us is um, was a slab yesterday and... They, you know, people kind of might, might care for a second that you're Garth Brooks or Trisha Yard, but they really just want to know, what can you do? Can you, can you, can you pick up a board? Can you use a hammer? Um, and being a part of the, the Jimmy and Rosalind part of work project has been what we've done for the last 15 years, every year. And um, we feel like even though they're not here, they're here because they are watching and they, and they are making sure everybody's working hard. So we just want to be a part of that. And we've been honored to, to get to do it. And we love the bill. We love to get to know the homeowner that's going to be living in the house. It's a, it's, it's just all love. I think my favorite thing is just the camaraderie. You know, uh, you get to meet people, new people, see people again over the year. But my favorite thing is being right next to the homeowners. You know, they say the seeds of happiness is gratefulness. And you're here and you see the gratefulness in them, which brings out the gratefulness in you. And you realize how spooled you are. And I think any time to sit there and reflect and just have that good talk with you, with the love of your life or with your higher power and just say thank you for the opportunity that I'm given every day. I think that's nothing but a good thing right there. The goal of the project is to build 27 homes. Having retired from public life, this marks the first time President Carter and First Lady Rosalind Carter have not been present at the build that bears their name. Today's event marked a week-long blitz of activity. This is a joyful day in Charlotte. You can hear a symphony of hammers behind us as hundreds and hundreds of volunteers are coming together to uh, build homes in, and bring attention to the desperate need for safety and affordable housing here in Charlotte, around the country, and around the world. Since 1984, when they put Habitat for Humanity on the map with their first volunteer build, the Carters have helped build and improve over 4,300 homes alongside more than 104,000 volunteers. 